Hola amigos, ¿cómo están todos ustedes? Hey guys, welcome back to the Language Tutor Spanish Podcast. Well, this episode is all about the word que versus cual. These are kind of confusing sometimes because they can both mean which and they can both mean what. So really we got to get those rules down. So what I want to do with you today during this episode is simply practice choosing which one you would use if you were to put the sentence into Spanish. And so what I want to do is call out 10 sentences in Spanish. And I want you to decide if I put this into Spanish, would I use the word que or would I use the word cual to say what or which? Okay, then we'll come back after we do these 10 and we're going to actually put these sentences into Spanish, the whole thing. All right. And so if you don't know a word in the second part, you can you can kind of listen, get that word and go back and repractice it. All right, well, let's get started. So decide whether we would use que or cual on these. So number one is, what is the date today? What is the date today? Que or cual? And that would actually be cual because we are using it before the verb ser and we're not asking for a definition. All right, so that's cual. Number two, what day is today? And that would be que. And do you know why it would be que? Because it's before a noun. There we go. All right. So number three, which do you prefer? And that is qual. It sounds like we've got several that we're looking at and we're choosing one of those. Okay. So that's qual. Number four, what type of car is your favorite? And that would be que because it's before a noun. All right. So number five. What time is it? And that is also que, it's before a noun. Number six, what is your address? And that is cual, because it is before the verb ser, and we're not asking for a definition. Number seven, which one do you want? Sounds like we're choosing from something. Which one do you want? And that would be qual, because yes, we do have some in front of us and we're choosing one of them. Number eight, how fantastic or that's fantastic. And that is que, the word que, to say those phrases that were we're really showing expression. How great, how fantastic, all those kinds of things. Number nine, what do you want? And that is que. It's just in general, it could be anything. It's what do you want? Okay. Number 10, what color are your socks? And that is also before a noun, so it would be que. And, you know, just a quick note in Spanish, we say of what color instead of what color. We say de que color. All right. So we've done those 10. Now let's move on to our next practice. All right. For this practice, we're going to use the same sentences, but we're going to actually put those into Spanish. The whole sentence. So here we go. Number one, what is the date today? And hopefully you said, ¿Cuál es la fecha? You might have said, ¿Cuál es la fecha de hoy? A lot of people say that as well. Either one works just fine. Number two, what day is today? All right, and of course we're going to use ¿Qué? Because it's before a noun, so it's ¿Qué día es hoy? ¿Qué día es hoy? Up next, number three is, which do you prefer? And that is simply, ¿Cuál prefieres? Stem changing verb, ¿Cuál prefieres? Number four, what type of car is your favorite? And 
And hopefully you said que tipo, T-I-P-O is type, tipo. Que tipo de auto es tu favorito? You might have also said que tipo de carro, which would be okay also. But que tipo de auto es tu favorito? Number five, what time is it? And that is simply, ¿Qué hora es? ¿Qué hora es? Number six, what is your address? And hopefully you said, ¿Cuál es tu dirección? Dirección is address, one word for address. So, ¿Cuál es tu dirección? Because it comes before ser, so we use ¿Cuál? Number seven is, which one do you want? Sounds like we're choosing from a group of things. Which one do you want? And that would simply be, ¿Cuál quieres? ¿Cuál quieres? Number eight, how fantastic, or that's fantastic. And that is, ¡Qué fantástico! ¡Qué fantástico! Number nine, what do you want? It could be anything. What do you want? And that is simply, ¿Qué quieres? ¿Qué quieres? And number ten, the last one, what color are your socks? And that would be, ¿De qué color son tus calcetines? ¿De qué color son tus calcetines? And, mis amigos, that wraps up this short and easy practice for the episode today. On K versus cual. I hope you guys have found this really beneficial, you know, but keep looking up those examples and keep coming up with your own scenarios to practice these words. Well, thanks for hanging out with me on this episode. I hope everybody is doing well. I wish for you and all of yours paz y bendiciones, peace and blessings, and I'll see you next time on the Language Tutor Spanish Podcast. Hasta pronto. Thank you.